Hey guys, it's me, Grace. I am back again today. So last night, posted a update video and it went up. Sorry, that was my door closing. So I said that I would post a daily routine makeup video after that, but somehow it got deleted off my phone. So I'm here today to make you another one. This time it'll be my normal routine. It won't be like the board type makeup. So as you can see, my hair is kind of like still damp, I want to say. I just got out of the shower. So I'm going to put my hair up and out of the way of my face. Because I used to do that. It's hard to do my makeup when it's like that. So let's get started. First, I apply the Clinique Moisturizer. This is the best thing ever to put on your face when you have dry or oily skin. You don't want to apply too much because if you do, I like it just feels like an oily touch. And sorry if you see me looking straight somewhere else is I'm looking in a mirror so I can apply it. So you can see I start under my eyes just because stuff can get there. I'm not looking at the door, I'm looking at the screen. Always happens. So yeah. And then I do apply it on my forehead as you can see it got veins again. Um, I just hold it up. Sometimes I have it up. It pulled back with this. I don't. As you can see, when you do get bangs, you get pimple. It's life. What's new? Sorry for that background noise. My brother's getting in the shower in his bath. Now, since I'm done, put that away, and we'll be taking eye primer from Ulta. This is the best stuff ever. You only want to apply a little bit on there because it will get like oily, pasty kind of feel in your eyes. So you want to do that, so I apply it on my eye. I don't do the best at applying it, but what you just want to do is make sure you get it all over your eyelid base. And make sure it's kind of like rubbed in good so you don't have any clumps or anything. Hold on. Getting my tile. Alright. Once you're done with that, you start, obviously, I start with my eyeshadow. I have, like, three kinds all right here. Some days I do use three. Some days I only use two. So, I use this Tartlet palette from Ulta. It's the best stuff I use. I only use some colors. I don't use the dark colors. Then you're going to pick out all your brushes. Of this brush I use got this from Claire's and I will be using super mom and free spirit these colors I kind of put on one at a time on my eyelids so it kind of just it gives me the base so that's what I do And I apply Free Spirit over my eyelids. Like, Free Spirit's like more of like a cream color. Super Mom is like a nude brown color, I would say. Or a tan color. Once I'm done applying a little bit of that, I either go to my Naked to Urban Decay palette. 
or I go to this new palette that I got from Ulta. It's uh, BH Cosmetics. It's called Galaxy Chick. And I'll show you the colors, but I won't be using that today. I do sometimes, but my eyes for some reason have like a bad reaction to it. Just if I don't put this stuff on. And so these are like the two main colors I use. And then all from the top row. I use, it's like a sparkling kit, I would say. Put that on my thing back there. So I'll be taking the Naked 2 Urban Decay palette. And my brush that came in it, that was out. I, as you can see, I use this color a lot. Oh, hello, you see me. And it's called Cop Chopper. Yeah. Because that's like the base of a new color, even though whenever I do my makeup, it doesn't show. I don't like doing vibrant colors on me or like make it like darker. I just like it to be natural. And sometimes I use Booty Call, which is the next color over here. Sometimes I use these two, but barely I use these two right here. More often. So I take a little bit of the chopper and I apply that kind of all over my lip, but I don't go as so hard where you can still see my other base colors I do. I sometimes go over a little bit more with it just to make it a little more like brighter or nudier <laughs> nudier funny 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 as you could see I have blue eyes so I kind of go based on the colors that would make my eyes pop and then I would take a little bit of booty cow and kind of like put it I would say your crease if that's what you call take my lean so that's normally all I do once I'm done applying it. Sometimes I do take my highlight and bronzer on my face, but today I don't. My basic daily routine for my makeup is this. Put moisturizer on my face, that's the important part. Um, eyeshadows on my eyes and the eye primer, of course. And sometimes I just do that. So, I'll show you the finished part. I do sometimes put mascara on. It's just right now I don't have any mascara. So, we'll just do that. It's probably hard to tell. But it's mainly done. And as you can see, my face is bright on camera. But it's not. I don't put any blush on or anything like that. Because... My face reacts to it not very well, and so I just do that. And I'm gonna show you this will be like a little mini vlog, too. I'm gonna show you my uh, OTDD if I probably said that wrong, but it's this little cute dress thing. Sorry if you can't really see it, but. That's what happens when you can't turn your phone around. But as you can see, yeah, there you go. It's a little dress, kind of romp dress thing with the off the cold shoulders from Target. I This thing would be normally down, but I tie it around just because it, it holds up the dress better. And I usually don't wear my dresses without any pants <laughs> underneath because... I don't like short dresses. And so that is my daily makeup routine and my OTTD outfit of the day. You said that wrong again. Great me. I'll see you later next vlog slash video. I um, will come on back on here Wednesday after school. First day of 10th grade, sophomore year. See you later. Bye.